much deeper about the vagus nerve. Not only is it important with this, okay, that the fact that this is all connected and it's all communicating through each other, and the gut is a humongous portion of it, okay, in the in the communication between the gut and the brain. But not only that, the vagus nerve itself, okay, is one of the primary pathways in to the parasympathetic nervous system. That's what's important to understand too, is that we can get ourselves into the parasympathetic nervous system much quicker by activating the vagus nerve. And by the way, if the gut is inflamed, okay, it's going to take us out of the parasympathetic nervous system, or at least it's going to, it's going to lean us in this direction towards sympathetic. We want to be in parasympathetic because once again, let me zoom in, this is where erections happen in the parasympathetic. It's rest and reproduce. That's where we want to be. Over here is fight or flight. That's where we don't want to be, right? So, because also not only does it not produce erections, it can actually tank erections, but it also promotes ejaculation. So it makes it much more likely we're going to have premature ejaculation. So we don't want to be in this nervous system when we're in the bedroom. We want to be over here. Okay, in the parasympathetic. And the vagus nerve is one of the most powerful ways to do it. And there's different ways to act. There's lots of different ways to activate the vagus nerve. Uh, one of which is making sure that your gut health is on point. That's one of the main things we're talking about today, the gut, because it's a huge part of it, right? Huge part of the vagus nerve is the gut. So we want that doing good so we, we can get into the parasympathetic nervous system. But since, if we look at here, the vagus nerve innervates the uh, vocal cords as well as the lungs and the heart, a very simple way to get into this is humming, primal deep breathing. That's what I call it. So we breathe in through the belly, and when we exhale through the nose, so a nice slow breath and then an even slower exhale with a hum. Very powerful in terms of getting us, activating that vagus nerve and getting us into the parasympathetic nervous system. Even just one breath can make a huge difference. So let's do that together. We're going to do one breath together. So I'm going to take, let's take a deep breath into your belly, through your nose. And you're going to exhale and hum. Mm I don't know about you, but I already feel more relaxed. Okay, just imagine doing that for three to five minutes. Okay, it's a great way to go into the bedroom. Get your get prime, get into that parasympathetic nervous system. So, you know, you're in that rest and reproduce. And that, well, like I said, this is one of the fastest ways to get there, right through the vagus nerve. And the humming is just one example. There's many different ways to do it, but that's a powerful one that you can do anytime, anywhere. All right, so let's look at, so we, we talked about this. I showed how parasympathetic is important for the erections. Let's look at this. There's not a lot of charts show this. This is really important to show how the vagus nerve connects to your penis as well as the vagina, right? The uterus and vagina. Now, that's important because you can turn your girl on <laughs> by turning on the vagus nerve in her, getting her to relax. This really helps, but also you. This, will, this helps stimulate those erections, right? And, and just have great erections. So you can see how it, they fuse together, right? So Because the other important part are these pelvic nerves that come out of your pelvis. Okay, that's real, that's, we talked a bit, little bit about that disease and trauma. I'm going to go more into that. But when you, can have, when you have injuries, right, especially down here lower, it can affect these pelvic nerves. Because that's a really important part of, of our erections as well. But so is the vagus nerve, right? Because these two interface with each other, right? So here, the vagus nerves come out, just like I was talking before, innervates the lungs, the heart. It's not showing the throat here, but it does the throat. The gut, way into the gut, and then interfaces, right? There's an interface right here called an autonomic plexus, where the vagus nerve interfaces with this nerve plexus coming out of the lower spinal cord, the pelvic nerves, 
Okay, these two together, vagus nerves with the pelvic nerves, innervate the penis. Really important to understand because you're affecting your penis directly by activating that vagus nerve. All right, very good. So now I want to move into one other thing on the gut real quick, which is really important, and that is <laughs> excess body weight in what's called metabolic syndrome. If you would like help with your unique and personal situation from us, I put a link below that will explain all the different ways that we can help you get and maintain superior stage four rock solid hardness and lasting power both permanently and naturally at any age. Make sure you like and subscribe for more tips to attain elite level bedroom performance and I will see you in the next one.